Hello! This particular video is going to take you into how to set up headers and hyperlinks. In the last video we spoke briefly about how to create a page. I recommend actually planning your page before you go in and edit it. Once you're ready, however, you can go to that red hyperlink, click, go ahead and click on it, and then you can actually start copying, pasting, typing, etc. directly into that edit box. I recommend making sure that you have sections with appropriate headers and starting with those. To do that, you can go ahead and actually click on advanced, tell it what heading level you want. I'm picking two because I want it to be a major heading. And then it'll actually start your markup for you if you haven't typed that in directly. This is a header two. You can tell that with the two equal signs. And then you can put in relevant text like, in this case, Western Travelers to the Ottoman Empire. I then right now I'm just going to put in a list because I want to show you guys what hyperlinking looks like. In which case, I want a bulleted list as opposed to a numbered list here. I'm going to type in Gertrude Bell's name. I'm then going to highlight that text and click on the link icon. And I'm going to say that it's to a wiki page. Wikipedia is recognizing that this page exists, so I don't have to copy the link in here. And then I just go ahead and hit insert link. And you'll notice the double brackets on either side of Gertrude Bell's name, which then indicates that this is text that is supposed to link to that Wikipedia article. I'm then adding in a comma outside those brackets and then the dates associated with her life. Once I'm ready, I'm going to go down the page. I'm not going to watch this page personally. And then I'm going to go ahead and show the preview to make sure that I've put my coding in correctly. I see that I've got a header and that one bulleted link. And when you're ready, you can actually publish the page. And voila, you have now seen how to add in a header with those double equal sign for header two, triple equal sign for header three, and then add in a bulleted list with a Wikipedia hyperlink. Don't forget to contact me, your history librarian, if you have any questions.